Today we're just going to do a demonstration of a two-touch body wrap. And what we're using here is an ace bandage. Um, they're a special sort of bandage that you can get for support, which has a stretch in it. Don't use crepe bandages because they can twist and hurt the dog. Um, but you can use these um, ace bandages. Or if you can't get hold of an ace bandage, uh, a good bandage to use is a, a horse tail bandage, which has a similar sort of stretch, but they are quite big. What we use these for is to give animals more awareness of their body and it helps build their confidence and give them security so they feel calmer quite often with them. So we're going to ask Moriarty to help us to do the demonstration and we'll start off with the wrap just folded up so that he can see what it is. Now Moriarty's already worn a wrap so we don't need to worry too much about him but if you're using this for the first time for a dog, then you really want to make sure that they're introduced to it so that you don't just come along and put a wrap on a dog, you introduce it. So if he was just introducing it for the first time, I might just let him sniff it. He's not really interested in sniffing it. Um, I might uh, offer him a treat on it, which I... Okay. And then I would just do some touches, do some circles over his body with it just to get him familiar with the feel of the material on his body. He's all right with that. We'll unfold it and we just take it so that we get the center of the wrap and we might just rest it over his back to start with so that he again feels it over him um, and see how that goes and if that's okay we'll then take the middle of it and just pass it across his chest. So you're taking the middle of your wrap across the chest and then you're crossing across over the back of, of your dog and you're wanting to take it underneath the body. So we might just start by just leaving it hanging there and seeing how he feels about that. He's okay with that. Um, and then we take it underneath the body and cross it under the tummy and we'll bring it up over the body. Now this wrap is quite small for Moriarty but um, we've just about done it. If I use a pin, we can use a pin to tie it, to, to um, fix it. Or if your dog's a bit uh, smaller, then you can tie it off. But make sure that the tie or the pin is off the spine so it's not right on his back. And that is a half wrap. So it goes the center of the wrap across the chest, cross over the back, come underneath the body and then bring it back up and tie it off just off centre. So to recap, place the middle of the wrap over the dog's chest, cross the ends over the back and bring the, them round under the belly. If you've got a large dog like Lewis, then you may not be able to bring the ends round for the third time. And if that's the case, just cross over the back and then tie off around the belly making a quarter wrap.